Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Read with me. Today I am here once again. I mean, I hope you all are doing really great and you all are fine in your own adventure named life. So it's been a long time since I have posted anything on this channel and for some days I, I was thinking of doing something on this channel i mean coming to this channel once again and um, i realized that i should because i had promised myself that i will post no matter what uh, because it's something that i really like and suddenly i stopped so i just realized as it is the channel i loved and i am i, I am in love with this and also this is something that i really enjoy so i should continue doing this whatever let's not talk much why am i here today is that uh, suddenly uh, nothing constructed but a thought uh, came in my mind that i should share some of my thoughts on something that i was reading and I was just wondering should I because uh, it will not be anything like I have done before because uh, beforehand always I used to come with the book and I said I used to say like uh, let's start right so it will not be anything like that uh, on the other hand uh, let me just uh, share one thing I kept the name of this channel read with me why because I thought um, I, I, I read a lot of books or I used to because nowadays I read a little less so what I thought wherever I will be reading some kind of thought will generate you know whenever you read so whatever thought will be coming in my head I will come to this channel and share with you because um, it's something that is very cozy and very uh, uh, you know a place a safe place for myself to come and to share so that was the goal for which i keep the name read with me so that i will be reading some book maybe i'm just coming here to share some of my thoughts to talk about something and i never did that i always read i and i enjoyed that as well today i will be reading some of the some of the portion that i really loved about this very first chapter that I was reading so that's why I am here there is this question I was I was reading this book can I share it with you I think I can please uh, please forgive me if there is any kind of mispronunciation or anything like that I just want to keep it very raw I I I, I know it's something different uh, something that even maybe it, it sound to you not that different but it is different for me because I I am a very conscious person like who is very conscious about doing wrong things so but I have learned that you never ask for the perfection until you start practicing so you can't say that you want 100% until you start without starting the one person so here i am starting my one person there is this concept called automatic writing uh, given by gertrude stein what i am trying to do is that automatic automatic reading i guess so i'm just keeping it raw i don't know how much uh, of you will like it um just i am doing it for fun and I think you enjoy it um, I will try my best let me know in the comment section do you like this kind of videos or not mm, yes so what happened I as I said that nowadays I really don't read much because of I, I should I don't I, I shouldn't give any kind of excuse so I should read a lot but I don't sorry but um, so I was searching for some books to read 
there are so many but i was searching for some books that will be short and something different i came across i i came across to a lot of books and i loved them the title and the little bit of whatever i came to know about those books i loved it then i screenshot it downloaded it and kept it i didn't read it once again but suddenly i was in instagram and a reels the attention uh, immediately went towards this book the name is you are uh, the name is let me find it out where it is uh, the power of now so um, now it is i am actually trying my best to give importance to this beautiful present moment naturally or you can say most of my life till now i used to be a overthinker who thinks a lot though i think it's not good but if you are then you are and you have to try your best to come out from it because i believe it's my opinion that when you overthink it never positive rather it is negative overthinking never is about something positive whenever you think a lot it tends towards becoming negative so when i you know like uh, read the title it was the power of now i thought i should read it because i am trying my best to give importance to this present moment and also there is this concept called carpe diem which means seize the day seize the moment right now because it is it is the moment when you can act you can never change the past because what has happened happened it's in the past you you can't undo the past in the similar similar manner in a similar manner you can't predict the future we can assume we can um, anticipate but even you can predict but you can confirm you can't confirm that this will happen so want without instead of wondering about the future i mean instead instead of worrying about the future and regretting the past we should give importance to this very moment right now for example now it is 8:35 pm so i have to give importance to this 8:30 pm moment whatever so i started reading this book the very first chapter it said you are not your mind the title you are not your mind um have you ever came across uh, have you ever come across to any video while it is saying that you are what you think i mean whatever you are constructing in your mind you are that that concept was different it's like if you are thinking you are bad you are bad continuously then it will definitely reflect on your face if you are telling yourself continuously that i don't have any confident i don't have any confident i am suffering from lack of confidence in my life so what will happen it will reflect on your face it will reflect on your activities so the meaning of what i said just now was that and the title says you are not your mind so what i had learned and what i am now reading was very contrasting isn't it i am now <laughs> reading it's wrong grammar so i was reading at that time so i just i said so i was reading at that time and what i had already learned there was a const- contrast sorry so i thought let's start reading it though i didn't read it uh, i mean i didn't read it completely yet the very first chapter i did or and there is a very beautiful story i want to share 
द चैप्टर सेज द ग्रेटेस्ट ऑब्स्टिकल टू एनलाइटमेंट एंड देन इट आस्क अ क्वेश्चन एनलाइटमेंट वट इज दैट एंड देर इज अ स्टोरी सो आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर दैट स्टोरी अ बिगर हैड बीन सिटिंग बाय द साइड ऑफ अ रोड फॉर ओवर थर्टी ईयर्स वन डे अ स्ट्रेंजर वर्कड बाय स्पेयर सम चेंज मम्बिल्ड द बिगर मेकनिकली होल्डिंग आउट हिज ओल्ड बेसबॉल कैप आई हैव नथिंग टू गिव यू सेड द स्ट्रेंजर देन ही आस्ड वॉट्स दैट यू आर सिटिंग ऑन नथिंग रिप्लाइड द बेगर जस्ट एन ओल्ड बॉक्स आई हैव बिन सिटिंग ऑन इट फॉर एज लॉन्ग एज आई कैन रिमेंबर एवर लुकड इन साइड आस्ड द स्ट्रेंजर आई आस्ड द स्ट्रेंजर एवर लुकड इन साइड नो सेड द बेगर वट्स अ पॉइंट देर इज नथिंग इन देयर हैव अ लुक इन साइड insisted the stranger the beggar managed to pry open the lid with astonishment disbelief and elation he saw that the box was filled with gold i am the stranger who has nothing to give you and who is telling you to look inside not inside any box as in the parable but somewhere even closer inside yourself i can hear you say but i am not a beggar let me stop here for some time this is a very first section of this book of this chapter sorry what it says it's it's beautiful i am not saying that i never have learned or heard about this i definitely have and but can you the the way it has been said it's so beautiful the story is so meaningful in spirituality there is this concept don't look outside for god it's always in there within you maybe actually when you when you know yourself when you know yourself i mean that is the enlightenment you know everything about yourself so many things are already inside you let me give you an example most of the time it happens that when a very challenging situation comes in our life we find out a very different kind of skill in ourselves for example suddenly the exam date has been announced and you haven't prepared at all but from somewhere <laughs> you get that energy you get that energy to read for some people it's for one month it's for six month and for some people it's only one day totally but my point is not who is right and who is wrong what i'm trying to say is that the man who or the or the people or us we maybe that the student hadn't read for 6 months but suddenly in one day for some kind of pressure he realized or she realized or they realized that i have the power i can do this and then we try our best so you find out the skill in yourself that i can read i can write i can study if i try my best if i give myself the time because i have the skill in me within me already inbuilt i just have to sharpen it i just have to practice it so it's a same kind of thing we search for confidence in the motivational videos i do that i did that sometimes but maybe if you just slowly try to learn yourself in various ways though i haven't mastered it yet but i realize that if we do 
we can so this story is a beautiful one i think i loved it so i thought of sharing it here as i said please forgive me for all if i have done any mispronunciation or grammatical mistake because i just don't want to be too concerned about all the things right now i just want to keep it raw i believe that i will improve in the coming days um i'm ending it here there is i i have so many things to talk about um but i just think uh, it will be enough for today um so let me know in the comment section what is your understanding of this story not only about the story about the video itself whatever i said if you have been um, listening it till the end i am really thankful and grateful for you being so patient and um yeah i mean you're so patient and loving thank you so much wishing you all guys a very 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 happy life ahead i will try my best to come with the um, with these little audios whenever it will be possible for me i am correcting myself not wherever or whenever i will i am trying to be regular from now on uh regular means at least one video per week at least so here i am bye bye for today i hope you enjoyed it i don't know uh, maybe you were not uh, and thank you for for all your support um it really means a lot wherever i find out some comment and it's it is saying like thank you we loved it uh, your voice is so sweet please continue reading it helps me a lot i i can't express my gratitude to you guys is just not possible and i'm not a very over expressive person as well so i i i just want you guys to know that yes i am really 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 grateful to all of you for all your love that i have felt um till now so wishing you a wishing you a very happy life and very prosperous life and a very peaceful life ahead uh, stay blessed and stay happy all the time um stay tuned to get to know um such beautiful stories um um uh, in the, in the in the near future so thank you thank you for today